ramen. There you go. And I cooked some pork. I filmed the video for this. So just watch out on how to cook this. And it's with a Korean paste. Um, I'll, I'll put it in here because I really cannot pronounce it. And then some dumplings. Let's eat. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Mm, it smells so good. And my drink is just water. Usually this ramen um, should be cooked with some, I mean, it should be soupy, but I don't really, I don't really, um, I just drain the water and then just mix the powder. Mm -hmm. Mm. Uh -huh. And then this is with vegetables, some green beans and pepper. Oh. There you go. Mm. Here's the pork. Mm -hmm. mm. A bit spicy. This is so delicious. So delicious. Oh, okay. I'm being good today. I'm not having any pop. I'm just having some pop. And obviously some dumplings. This is Korean dumplings as well. Um, in a fry cola. Mmm. This ramen is a bit spicy. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. And this one. Guys, you really have to try this. I mean, cook this and then try it. It's so easy recipe. If you, if you can get the paste that I use, And it goes really well with this ramen as well. This dumpling is a vegetable. Mm. 
so good. Mm. What I'm going to do, um, I'm just going to put some sauce on the dumpling. <laughs> A bit spicy, a bit sweet. It's just so good. Mm. I forgot to tell my husband, but I will tell you. <laughs> so I ran this morning, and then there is this lady looking so upset. So I stopped. Then I asked her, what, What's the matter? Are you okay? Um, and then she said, Oh, I lost, um, I lost my dog. You know, this white, like white fluffy dog. Um, and then I said, oh my goodness, obviously I have my molly and if I will, you know, if I'm gonna, you know, if I lost my molly, I'll be like, I don't know what to do. Anyway, so I said, um, you know, I will help you. I will help you find your dog. And then, and she said, um, I lost her only about 10 minutes ago. She was off the lead. The dog was off the lead. And obviously if you're, if you're an owner. Um, you know your dog well but she said the dog was running towards the other dog and then the other dog was so um was a bit aggressive so her dog went off and it went inside the the, the um the cornfield you know the last video that i no not my last video but one of my videos um i have vlog about the cornfield and then we got that we got that and then the dog was there in the middle and um looking so upset oh and then it breaks uh, it really breaks my heart the dog's fine the dog was absolutely fine i think she was just she was just a bit upset with that dog. She was fine. And the good thing about it is because she was running, we can hear the dog because she's got a, a name tag and the name tag has got this like like a little bell. She was running, we can hear um we can hear her. 
So we were just following the um the noise and then she stopped and because she heard the, the owner. She was fine, she was absolutely fine. It's just I mean she was she was she was fine because the owner found her. I mean, me and the owner found her. But she's not fine because she was a bit, you know, she was a bit upset with the other dog. Yeah, that was my running morning. <laughs> Because I like running outside, you see a lot of, you know, stuff going on, people walking, people cycling, so, you know, and then where I run, you see a lot of um, dogs, because that's where we walk our dogs, but yeah, it's a bit upsetting. The owner of the dog that made made the other dog upset. She was so apologetic. So she put her dog in a lead. And she was so apologetic though. Which is really nice of her because some 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 owner would just like leave. But she stayed until we found the um the other dog. There's a more. Oh so good. Mm. Guys, I'm so full now. This will be my um food for I think for two days. <laughs> I love it. Anyway, that will be my food for the next two days. And yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time sucking video. Bye! <music>